driving around talking. <laughs> uh, what you guys just saw was a, uh, a Jeep meetup. It's called Crawlers and Coffee. Um, let me explain myself first before we talk about that. So this last weekend on Friday, I went to Vegas to go see my uncle and, and cousins and a bunch of family. On Saturday morning, we went, out, went over to this uh, thing, the Jeep meetup called Crawlers and Coffee. And uh, we checked out all the, car, the cool Jeeps that were there. The one that stood out really the most to me was the LJ on one tons with 42 inch tires. That was crazy. It had 42 inch tires. Okay, so today I have some real exciting big news today. Well, there's a lot of things going on today. First thing we're doing right now is um, we're getting a new passenger for the Jeep today. And then uh, after that, we are having a party for my grandparents' 50th anniversary today, a surprise party for them. So everyone's getting stuff ready at the house and uh, I'll show you guys that later. But first, let's meet our new passenger. You can do it. Come on, Morsi. Help. <laughs> hey, come here. Come on, down. He doesn't go with us much. Yeah. Yeah. He stays at home mostly. Yeah. Because yeah. I've, I've, yeah. I've got eight of them. Mm -hmm. <sighs> this way. Come on. Ready? Wait, watch, watch it, watch it. Watch it. There you go. Come on. Oh, Come on. Wait, one another one? Here, watch. Watch it. Watch, sit. Very sit. Watch. Take it gentle. Alright guys, are you ready to meet the new passenger of the Jeep, the Sean's Jeep Life? You can probably see all the hair I got on my face right now, but here he is. His name's Brody. He's an Australian Shepherd. He's about nine months old. And just look at him. Brody, Brody, look at, so look at his eyes. Look how beautiful that is. So uh, the other day, like two weekends ago, I was uh, driving in through Chino and I stopped at the Maverick, which is a gas station in town, if you guys don't know. And uh, I met his his parents there and uh, the breeder that had him. I pulled up next to him not knowing anything. I got out and I, I saw the two Australian Shepherds that they had in the back and they were really beautiful dogs. And they're saying that there was an older couple and they were saying that uh, they were getting out of the business and they wanted to sell Brody and they showed me, oh, they, I didn't see a picture of him at all. Uh, so they showed me the flyer they had for him. They just said he was a, a black tri and a blue Merle. That's what his parents was. And they both had a red mural, mural, mural jean. So he turned out being a red mural, Merle, Australian Shepherd. And just look at him, he's so, he's so cute. And uh, they're selling him for a really good price and just he's an awesome dog he's really well behaved he's really well behaved for nine months so now we gotta get back to that party uh get brody a little bit situated with me and uh the house there and take it from there <laughs> and 
I'm super excited, guys. All my adventures now, I'm not gonna be alone. You know, I used to bring Cora with me, but she's getting older now. She can't get up in the Jeep by herself anymore. So, and he's about as big as he'll get right here. Uh, sadly, I didn't get to have him when he was a puppy. He still is a puppy, he's only nine months, but they grow up really fast, so. Sadly, I didn't get to see him when he was a puppy, but I got pictures. He took a lot of pictures of him. So there's that. And uh, let's get back to this party. And I was supposed to just go out and get cups and ice. So they're gonna ask why I was out for so long. And I'm gonna show up with Brody. <laughs> Hopefully they love him, because I can tell I like him a lot. Look how good he is. He just, he's just chilling. He loves the Jeep. Got a certified Jeep dog now. So we'll see how he plays with the other dogs, with Cora. See if Cora gets jealous. I think Cora might get a little bit jealous, but she'll get used to it after a little while. So there's Brody. 